Hey everybody, it's your girl Shula. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back with another video on my locks. I am officially now 13 months locked. Yeah, you heard me. 13 months. June makes my 13 month being locked. And I got my retie done. So y'all know whenever I get my reties and it becomes a new um adventure in my logs I want to share with you guys. <laughs> Yay! Applause, 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 applause. Anyway, I hope y'all have been following my journey. If you have not been following my lock journey, follow my lock journey, okay? Anyway. Oh, I gotta tell y'all something. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Y'all, y'all know my concoction that I use on my locks. Yeah. Well, I started doing something a little different to my locks. And I know I may have said it on another video. Um, or maybe I told it to somebody that I met in a store where I was in Georgia. Mm. But anyway, if you're listening, young lady. Mm -hmm. Okay. This is my concoction that I use for my hair. Now, I normally either braid my locks, twist out my locks, and roll them up. But just here recently, I just take and just put this on my hair at night. No, 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 sorry. X that out. This goes on my, in my, my concoction goes in my hair in the morning. In the morning, okay? I have a new concoction, y'all, that I use in my hair. <laughs> And I noticed since I've been using this, I saw it from another YouTuber that's a that's a do her locks. But I noticed on my hair, my hair texture, that when I put it in my hair, it's actually making my ends seal up. It's locking my hair, y'all. And I'm gonna show y'all what it is that I use in my hair and that's been locking my hair. So drum roll, please. Here it is. y'all don't have none of this and y'all within y'all year of being locked or even after it doesn't matter y'all need to get some of this and it's not expensive i got it from uh amazon.com i'm not sponsored y'all not sponsored on nothing but it's a lot of body with coconut and sheet oils and it's wrapped me foaming mousse and i kid you not y'all when i saw um the lady um uh you that used this put it on here locks are beautiful i can't even remember the youtuber's name because i watched so many of them but listen 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 linda listen listen linda 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 listen a lot of body and i i tell you this is my i think this is my third bottle since i started using it is it my third bottle might be my second maybe my second Maybe my third. I don't know. I'm addicted to y'all. Anyway, so I put this on my hair at night when I either do a twist out or um, braid out or I just put it in my hand and just rub it in my hair and then pull my hair up in a ponytail and then just put my cap on it and go to bed. But I kid you not, you guys, this stuff right here, if you guys have locks, and you're saying, oh no, I can't lock faster. I'm telling you, so when I start using this right here, I notice a difference in my locks. I don't know if y'all can notice a difference, y'all can see, but listen, I notice a difference in my locks, literally notice a difference in my locks. And my hair is still so soft, it's still so soft. Now, in the morning, when I take my, my braid outs or my twist outs or my ponytail down, before I even touch my hair, before I even touch my locks, I spray this in my hand. Take it up first because you know this is my concoction. I have peppermint essential oil in here. I have uh, coconut oil in here, organic. I have distilled water in here. And I have my Pantene. If you guys go go check out my video. Y'all check it out and it shows you everything I got in here. But yeah, I spray this right here on my hand. And then before I even touch my hair, and then I and then I just take my my braids or my whatever I have in my hair off. But yeah, so this is what I do. I shake this up right here. Now you spray it out. Mm. I can smell the peppermint, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. And spray it on my hand like this. 
see how thin that layer is through this and this this is all i do y'all when i take my hair down this is it oh yeah so refreshing now you can spray it directly on your hair if you want to but i don't have to and you don't have to either but you can if you want to spray it on your hair like this you can spray it on your hair but when you do it it's like oh it's so refreshing so yeah you can spray it on your hair too now um i still have issues with my perimeter in the back coming loose and she has to reestablish it every time i go back but i'm getting more and more less that has to be reestablished so that's a good thing. I think it's like maybe two on this side and like two on this side. And it's like, it's these, it's, 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 it's in the back, but it's on my edges on these sides, not in the middle, but on these sides. So I don't know, my hair is just soft. And, and I think because maybe uh, when I'm taking my shower, I get, oh, and another thing you guys, y'all want some really nice moist locks. I'm gonna tell you my other secret, you guys. Are you ready? The magic ball is turning. Are you ready? <laughs> I steam my locks. I steam myself. I used to wear a shower cap in the shower so I wouldn't get my hair wet. And then I saw another YouTuber that has locks. Says she does her steam shower while she's doing her showers. And I always bathe and shower in hot water because I like my baths hot. And so, what I've done now, I've been doing this now for about two plus months. Yeah, about two plus months. I get in the shower without any type of shower cap on. I'm not going like this, get my hair all wet up. I'm just letting the steam in the shower just steam my locks. And I notice a difference. I do, I notice a difference. And the, another good thing about locks, you guys, is because you don't lose hair like normally when you like loose naturally when you comb your hair you know you're looking to comb like oh the hair's in there or hair's in the sink or hair's on the floor or hair somewhere but when you have locks because all of the hair it, that you that you used to lose they don't go anywhere they're in your locks so they stay in your locks so that's why your locks get fuller that's exactly why your locks get fuller because your hair is not uh, the strands are not falling out of your hair. They're staying within the locks. Go figure. And you, if you do decide to get locks, you're going to have your favorite locks. You know, I have my favorite locks. I have I have one lock that I said, ooh, if I, if I wanted to, I could use this lock, right? And, and I tell you, I know, you, know your, you know your favorite locks. This is this one right here. It's got a little fat end right there. I'm like, how did that end right there get that little fatness to it? It's because your hair when you start losing hair it goes somewhere and so it's there so yeah so i'm kind of partial to this one right here All right here this one right here so yeah it used to be a little bit longer but because it's been like weaving itself within itself it's it's a little shorter but it's solid it's like solid like a rock so if i when i start wearing hair ornaments I'm, that's gonna be the first place I put it. I'm thinking about. I'm thinking about just getting. You know, I don't have pierced ears. Well, I have one that's pierced and one that's not because that looks split. But I'm thinking about getting earrings. You know, the earrings that's got the little um, uh, the ones you just slide through your hole. I'm thinking about. Get, don't be taking my ideas, y'all. Yeah, I said it. Uh huh. I'm thinking about just getting that and just putting it through that fat piece of my hair and just let it just dangle there and just dangle what y'all think huh anyway enough of that but if you guys want to follow my journey go check out my playlist i have a playlist on shella and frank i have a playlist in promo sdk reality tv about my locks and i want y'all to follow i am 54 years old <gasps> as of may this year y'all i haven't had a birthday and when i got my locks i was i hadn't even turned 53 when i got my locks you guys I had not turned 53 because when my daughter installed my locks in, in my, on Mother's Day last year, my birthday wasn't until May 25th. So I was in my 53rd year, but I wasn't even 53 years old. So yeah, 
I have my locks now and now it's been over a year 13 months and now I am on my 54th year and I'm locked and I'm loving it I'm loving it you guys you can't tell me I didn't do the right thing actually I didn't even know I was doing the right thing until I did the right thing okay but yeah, if you guys are looking to get locks and you want permanency in your hair, because honey, I ain't cutting it. This, this ain't going nowhere. This is this is this is it. I literally don't have to do anything with my hair. I don't have to style. And, and, and let me tell you, people used to say that washing their hair was like a nightmare. It is so simple. When I wash my hair, guys, I I take like big chunks. I do like a big braid here, a big braid here, a big braid here. I like four braids in my hair. I take a big piece and do it. And then I go in there and I, and I put my um, my Loxanity shampoo in my hair. And I, first I, I drench my hair first with water. Yeah, I drench it with water in the shower. And then I take and I, I water down my shampoo because you don't want to put thick stuff in your hair, but it's Loxanity, it's four locks. But you water it down, make it a little thinner and then you just lather it up in your hair. And I normally, just, after I lather it real good, I normally let it sit and I go ahead and clean my body, shower and thing. And then when I'm done with that, I go back to my hair and I, get it all rinsed out again. Then I put me a little bit more in there and then get it all saturated. And then I get me a t-shirt. Yeah, you guys get a t-shirt. Do not be using no cotton towel because you, you say you get lint. You don't want no lint in your locks, okay? okay? You don't want no lint in your lock. So then you get your t-shirt. If you got a husband, get your husband t-shirt because that's what I did. I got my husband t-shirt. Yeah. And I put it on my hair tie, and then tie it and then and let it, it excess water drip off. About 15 minutes of, of letting my hair stay that way, I took it off because I normally wash my hair right before, the day before I go get my, my installation. No, no. I normally wash my hair the day before I go get my retightenings done. In the middle of me getting my retightenings done, I like every, like, like a second or third week I wash my hair, but right because I get my I get my retightenings done every six every five weeks. Six weeks is like pushing it because of my new growth. So every five weeks, but between the second and like maybe second and a half week, like right in the middle, I wash my hair. And then, um, so what I do when I wash my hair after I take my the the, the t shirt off my hair. I take, because you want your hair moisturized, you don't want your hair like bone drop, because I'm telling you, the Loxanity shampoo, it strips your hair, it strips your hair, it strips your hair, it takes all the whatever out your hair, it's, it's stripped, okay. So, I use my concoction, and I spray my concoction on my hair, and then I put this on my hair, yeah. And then I just kinda like, mush my hair in like this, you know, make sure it gets in there real good, like squeeze it like that. And then, I put, um, because you know still my hair is still in those little plaits four plaits and then I put the t-shirt back on my hair and then seal it and then I let it stay on there for about maybe a few hours and then and then and then I take it off and then I put my regular hair net on my head because by then all the excess water is gone yeah so yeah and I'm telling you I love washing my hair now but first when I first had my locks I'm like Oh, I'm gonna do this and wash my hair. But now, nah, honey, I love, I mean, I got my little routine, got my little system, and it's so easy. You guys can follow it, it's so easy. And I get my stuff done. And then, so now, when I get um, back to the lactician, my hair don't be looking like, y'all know, y'all seen me a couple times when I came back from the lactician and I did not do this routine. And I came back from the lactician and my hair was so dry. Because you know it's dry, you stripped it, okay? But honey, now that I do this, I don't have to worry about coming back. Look at my hair, y'all. Do it look dry to y'all? Mm -hmm. Oh, y'all wanna see my hair. Let me show y'all my hairs. All right, I'm gonna show y'all my hairs. I'm gonna show y'all my hairs. Y'all wanna see my hairs? I'm gonna show y'all my hairs. All right, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Oh, let me sure y'all can see. Let me make sure y'all can see. Okay, y'all ready? I forgot to show y'all this. Okay. This is the back. All right, here we go. Okay. 
And then, should I get all up in here? Right here. And then, of course, my side. And then it just flows right back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, you can't beat this with a stick, y'all. Okay? Who has time to be dealing with hair? I ain't got no time to be dealing with no hair. I got had neck surgery, got screws in my neck, got carpal tunnel, got a lot of stuff going on, y'all. I ain't got time to be fooling with my hair. So these locks, y'all, lock nation. And I keep saying every time, I'm gonna dye my hair, and then then it's like, no, I'm I'm loving my grays. I'm loving my grays, y'all. Y'all see that? I'm loving my grays. They just blend so well, and it's like, you know what? I'm not I'm not. I'm, I'm, I think I'm. Look at this. Look at that. You see the gray just entwined in there, but also not just it, that it's entwined in there. It's also my brown hair is in there too. So it kind of like levels it out. Like, like girl, it like. Did you dye your hair? No, honey. I didn't dye my hair. Mm -hmm. No, honey. No, honey. No, honey. But, honey, it's there. You see that gray? Look at it. And like I say, the, the hair, it just stays in the lock. It just stays in the lock. It doesn't go anywhere. It stays in the lock. But, yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Y'all subscribe. Come part of my Oh Yeah Baby today. Subscribe and follow my lock journey. Y'all, I'm excited about it. And I want you. If you want to start a journey, be excited about it too. And trust the process because it is worth it. It is so worth it, baby. Yeah. To the next video. Bye. What's up? What's up, you guys? It's your girl, Shella. Erfurg. Come on over and check out our channel. Promo SDK Reality TV. Husband and wife where we eat good in the neighborhood we're a mukbang eating show cooking and recipes especially soul food pranks on frank oh y'all go check it out challenges vlogs comedy skits short videos and tiktok so come on and become our oh yeah baby today subscribe to our channel follow us on instagram promo sdk promo sdk or you can also go to any of our social sites and find us under promo stk oh yeah baby we can't wait to see you we can't wait to meet you so come on over